The number one thing that makes or breaks a typography product design is the font you choose. To make sure your designs look awesome, we joined forces with Sarah from Wholesale Ted and gathered a list of 10 of our favorite fonts. These fonts not only look amazing on different types of print-on-demand products, but they're also free. And now let's meet Sarah and get right into it. Hey Sarah. Hey Fredful, thank you so much for having me on your channel. I am looking forward to sharing some of my favorite free fonts and font styles with your viewers. Yay. All right, so let's talk about a very unique style of font that a lot of people don't think about, and that is kanji fonts, which I'm probably mispronouncing, sorry. If you've never heard of kanji before, it's one of three Japanese writing systems. Kanji is the traditional way of writing in Japan, and it's also culturally very significant too. And the kanji font style has become super trendy online and for print on demand products because of the rise in Japanese streetwear clothing. Because you see, while streetwear originated in the USA, over time, people started looking abroad to Asia for lesser known streetwear brands so that they could stand out in a crowd. And that is how Japanese streetwear took off. People loved it because it was different and unique. And so if you would like to take advantage of this trend for yourself, then a great free font that you can use is Dala Gothic One, which is available in both English characters and in kanji characters. Next up is 100 year old trend that's making a comeback in 2022, Art Deco. Yes, the art style that ruled the roaring 20s is back with its geometric and elegant simplicity. But why now? The answer, nostalgia. The signature Art Deco features such as symmetry and geometry are used to reflect order and stability, which is something we could use a little more of these days. This graphic design is represented by straight lines, geometric shapes, and elongated sans serif font without small details. The Plaza font captures the simplistic Art Deco vibe and is available for free to download on your computer or to use on Printful's Design Maker. Combine the Plaza font with a monochromatic color palette, geometric shapes, and you have an Art Deco inspired design. To make the design process easier for you, our graphics team has added a wide range of Art Deco shapes and elements to the Design Maker's clip art collection. Feel free to incorporate these graphics into your product's designs. The Art Deco inspired typography designs will work well on posters and other home design elements like pillows and blankets. Here's an example of an Art Deco inspired design made by only using our Design maker. My next style of font that customers love are dictionary style fonts. Now, you might be thinking to yourself, well, gee, Sarah, why do customers love dictionary style fonts so much? Well, it's because funny or cute dictionary entries have become super popular when they're paired with print on demand products. So to create one of these for yourself, take a word and then create a dictionary entry for it that has a cute or funny meaning. For example, take the word teacher. Now, while a standard dictionary entry for this might be a person who teaches, especially at a school, we can instead turn this into a funny or cute dictionary entry by making it instead teacher. A multitasking hero with eyes on the back of their head that motivates, encourages, and inspires students. And now we've created a cool design that we can print onto products that students can buy as a gift for their favorite teacher. And so if you would like to take advantage of this trend for yourself, then a great free font that you can use is the Adobe font Carmina, which is actually used in real dictionaries. It's not just the 1920s making a comeback. Groovy 70s are still alive and well. The funky 70s look is back in style, and I can see why. This fun and colorful style is both easy to create and easy on the eyes. If you're into the groovy vibe, a font that really embodies the nostalgic and cheerful aesthetic of the 70s is Candice. It's available for free as a download and available to use on Printful's Design Maker. Combine this font with a funny or cute quote and you've got an eye-catching design. This is a great font for product design because it works well in both printed and embroidered designs. Play around with this typography style by creating clothing with big and bold designs as well as a more subtle pieces with just embroidered text. Another 70s trend that's making a comeback is tie-dye. So why not combine one of these tie-dye products with the funky 70s typography for a vibrant street style piece? Take a look at these examples to get inspired. A very cool style of fonts are science fonts. Now, these are fonts that you would find on scientific posters or books, and you can pair these fonts with a range of different niches, not just sciencey niches. So as an example of this, take periodic symbols, you know, the symbols that you see on a periodic table that list all of the elements. Well, a popular print on demand trend is to create your own periodic symbols. So a really funny one I've seen people do is they've created their own periodic symbol for the phrase eh, as in E-H, and they've called it the element of Canadians since 
Canadians use the phrase eh a lot. And so now you've created a really funny and cute design that's great for gifts that people buy for their Canadian friends. And so if you'd like to give this a go for yourself, then you can use the free Google font Inter, which looks very similar to the traditional periodic table font. If you're looking for something sleek and elegant, we've got you. This subtle typography style has decorative strokes and a beautiful sophisticated design that will help your product stand out. To achieve this polished look, I recommend the Magiona display font. Use it as a standalone design element or combine it with minimalistic graphics. Here's an example created with our design maker. The Magiona display font is pretty versatile and you can create designs with monochrome color palettes as well as bright ones. If your ideal customer loves luxurious designs, I suggest you test this font out on one of our premium products like the unisex premium hoodie or faux leather bomber jacket. The premium quality product and the elegant text design combo will create timeless and durable wardrobe staples. Here's a beautiful piece that our graphic design team came up with. All right, so a very popular and very trendy style of font are handwritten fonts. These are fonts which are designed to look like someone is actually writing the text out by hand. And when it comes to handwritten fonts, you've got tons of great choices and tons of great styles such as cursive or childlike. But for this video, I thought we would focus in on one handwritten font, Amatic SC, which is a free Google font. This is a very fun font and it can be used in lots of different ways. The best word that I've heard people use to describe it is humanistic, which I think is a great way to describe it because it has lots of little imperfections which make it look like a human legitimately wrote it and it makes it much more personal. And this is why this font is often used for clothing which has a word or phrase on it which describes how the person who's wearing it is feeling. And so a great example of this is I've seen people make t-shirts, hoodies and things like that with the phrase nope, which is perfect because of the humanistic style of the font. And so when you see someone wearing a t-shirt featuring the word nope in that font, it looks like the person themselves actually wrote it and is therefore saying it to you themselves. For a cozy vibe, go with the farmhouse style font. What exactly is farmhouse style? The farmhouse aesthetic has a long history originating from actual farms in 16th and 17th century Europe. Over time, this aesthetic has spread worldwide and taken on its own twist that we often see in both architecture and interior design. It's especially popular in the US, even several centuries later. If I had to describe the farmhouse style in two words, I'd say it's rustic and cozy. To give your typography design a homey feel of the farmhouse style, combine the number seven font with a few graphic elements. This typography style will work best with home decor such as posters, pillowcases, or the rustic enamel mugs. Stick to a neutral color palette to bring out farmhouse style's soothing, rustic feel. If this typography style speaks to you, check out our clip art collection where you'll find matching design elements. If you're looking for a great font to pair with a funny word or phrase, then I highly recommend considering typewriter style fonts. These are of course fonts that are designed to look like old typewriters. When it comes to this font style, you've got lots of free options, but a really good one is the Google font Special Elite. Now you might find that a bit strange. Why is it that typewriter fonts do well when paired with funny words or phrases? Well, the reason is because typewriter fonts are neutral and that's important because that's exactly what dead pan humor is. Deadpan humor is purposefully dry and devoid of emotion. In other words, it's neutral. And so if you take a funny joke or word and combine it with a neutral typewriter font, the result is that you get a hilarious deadpan design. And so if you love telling dry jokes, then you will love typewriter fonts. Last but not least, Bold typography. Chunky fonts with a thick strokes are in this year. Bold typography will be a great fit for your store, especially if your customers are not fond of subtle and shy designs. A font that fits this description well is Antique Olive Nord. If you decide to go with this typeface, go all in. Play around with the negative space and placement of words. Don't hesitate to fully take up the space, leaving a next to zero empty space. If your product has a message for the world, it won't go unnoticed. I can promise you that a design with this chunky font will for sure be a head turner. You can go with a bright product and and neutral font colors such as black, gray, and white. Or flip it around and use popping font colors on a neutral canvas. Either way, your design will look impressive and daring. I recommend you try out bold typography design on one of our posters or t-shirts. 
So I hope that one of my fonts inspired you and thank you again, Printful, for having me on your channel. It's been great to be here. It's been great having you here, Sarah. Thank you for recommending all of these amazing fonts. As for you, if you've got an idea or amazing typography design and you're wondering which products to put it on, we prepared something special on Sarah's channel. We'll give an inside scoop on the best-selling products as well as tips on how to successfully sell them. Go take a look by clicking here or you can find a link in the description below. I hope you found this video useful. Thank you for watching and see you on the next one. Bye.